This Taiwanese chicken soup is packed full of goodness. It's a healthy kick from a boozy soup. Taiwanese sesame oil chicken soup. Welcome back to Wok Wednesday. I am Jeremy from School of Wok, and this is London's Asian cookery school. If you don't know it already, now you do. And this dish is so easy, but it's one of those dishes that, you know, it's great if you've got a cold. It's really sort of, in Chinese and Taiwanese tradition, we love soup. Any type of soup just works, but chicken soup just makes you happy. We're gonna start with a simple base of ginger and spring onion. I'm actually gonna listen to my mother-in-law and keep the ginger peel on here because it's a really nice clean bit of ginger and it's just gonna add more goodness to this goodness gracious soup. <laughs> A little bit of oil. I don't want too much oil in there, just enough to sear the ginger. I quite like to sear the ginger to a point that it gets really nice and golden brown before I add anything else to this. Now, soup is a bit of a joke in my family with my wife. She always says that, you know, in Chinese culture, you, you, you can soup anything and you, you, you actually really can. <laughs> And the idea of it is that we drink soup, it's that sort of hot, almost stock, it's very, very thin, to sort of make us feel more refreshed in a really strange way because it's a hot drink. To be honest, I even go as far as being the sort of middle-aged Chinese man that I am, that every night I have a cup of hot water before I go to bed. If I could, if I had the time to make a cup of soup like this every day, even better. Now to get a really nice sort of clean soup, I'm just turning the heat down to medium heat and then I'm gonna add my spring onion and then we'll bring the chicken's legs in in a second. Very roughly chopped spring onion is all you need. I'm keeping it on a medium heat. I've got this Taiwanese rice wine, which if you give it sort of, it's got this sort of sweet aroma to it. And I need quite a lot of this, about 500 mils. Whilst the alcohol is bubbling out of that, I'm gonna add some rock sugar, which is this crystallized sort of sugar or well, this sugar crystal, and that's gonna melt into that boiling hot rice wine. You're thinking, this is a sweet chicken soup. How strange. And right now, yes, if I just drank it like that, I'd basically just drink a syrup, a ginger and spring onion syrup. But we will season it with some salt later on. I'm gonna get the chicken in, in a second. What I'd like to do is melt that rock sugar into the rice wine first, and that sort of, nice sort of natural sweetness combined with the mellow sweetness of the rice wine just works. It's quite medicinal. Now, if you're talking traditional cooking method for this type of Taiwanese soup, you sear the chicken in the same pan and then use the chicken from there. But actually, I quite like this to be as sort of clean a soup as possible. And I've got five quite, what were quite chunky chicken legs here that I just want to get nice and brown and leave any excess sort of fat aside. So I've just popped it in the oven, 200 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. Nice and easy that way. I'm actually just gonna quickly just marinate this. And this is again, my way of doing it for ease. I'm going to use some black sesame oil and you might see different recipes where you cook the chicken in the black sesame oil. I find sesame oil has quite a low smoking point so I don't want too much smokiness in this which is why I kept it more for this marinade. That black sesame oil is going straight over my nicely browned chicken and then a good 
pinch of salt around the chicken and that will just seep into the soup. If I need more seasoning later on, we can use it then. Just get all that flavour around the chicken and that can go slowly into this stock here. And the colour from that roasted chicken skin will just slowly melt into that soup and that stock. Very, very simple, natural flavours work a treat. And that's what I think makes it so sort of tasty. Even though it's, some people you think, oh, this is just boiled chicken, but sometimes you just need this. Now remember, this so far is just the base ginger and spring onion, rice wine, the Taiwanese rice wine, and your seasoned chicken bit of rock sugar to sort of bring out the natural sweetness of the chicken itself. Cover it with some chicken stock. Still on a medium heat. Bring that to a boil. Let it simmer away. I'll get a lid onto it for that simmering for about 20 to 30 minutes. So this soup has been boiling for half hour to an hour it's up to you really however much flavor you want to get into it and it'll have that sweetness so i'm just going to season that quite heavily with salt now before we have a little taste mm. and we should get a really lovely sort of sweet salty stock from that and a real hit of the black sesame oil. So I've actually cooked this for a bit longer than I would usually, but to be honest, the longer you cook this soup, the tastier it becomes and the softer the chicken becomes. And as I say, this is one of those dishes that is just great for when you've got a cold or anything like that. So just shred up your chicken. It's almost like every single culture has their own chicken soup that your mum or dad or uncle or auntie or granddad, grandma would have made. So it's got to be someone from the older generation that just makes you feel good. My sesame oil, Taiwanese chicken soup. Really unique flavour that from the Taiwanese rice wine and that rock sugar. And I say medicinal, but it's actually just got this lovely lingering sweetness to it. You're gonna love it. If you like this recipe, if you wanna learn more, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, ding, hit that notification bell, and we'll see you later.